attacking five obscura paintings for a client. Handle it, Rana. Greetings and welcome back to some more Lara Croft Tomb Raider, The Angel of Darkness. And I believe we're going on to the um, gallery under siege, isn't it? Yes, it is. Finally, I get to meet uh, Mr. Creepster himself. Oh, dramatic music is playing again. It's like we're back in a Parisian back street. Or am I misremembering? Is this music specifically for this bit of the game? Um, other way, other way, other way. I like this stonework actually. I do like a bit of stonework in a game. It looks nice. Oh, where am I going? Right, through this door I take it. Oh, actually maybe I should just check. Is that the right? Yes, weapons. Uh, where is that? Of course he's going to de-arm us, isn't he? Oh, my beautiful, uh, my beautiful stun gun. Was it that? Right, okay. Uh, effective at turns. Yes. Right, okay. Exit. Why does it... Oh, the buttons on my controller just do not want to actually exit out of a menu. Oh, he said something different. How exciting. Oh my god, Lara. Is this, um, this is the place we were in. Oh, this is the place we were in. Her hair is very shiny. I've just noticed that. But I suppose if you've been hanging out in the Parisian back streets, you don't have time to actually wash. Why does it sound suddenly like there's traffic in inside the building? Hmm. Well, that is what you get for having... Yes, that's what you get for having an air vent right above the Mona Bloody Lisa. Oh, this is actually reminding... What? That's a couple of weird shots, because there was nothing you could actually... You couldn't actually make anything out there. Okay, maintain radio silence. But maybe that's another example of it not being polished because it didn't have time to properly finish it. Have your targets. Move out. Right, well, stun gun. Hi! On bush blue. <laughs> Dude, I am not your biggest problem in this place right now. Oh uh, no, are we going to start cho- okay. Breathe. Oh, wonderful. Oh, yes! Where was that though? That was back at, um... Oh my god, Lara! Right, put the gun away. See, she, she insists on doing all this- um, jumping about when she's actually got the guns out. Right, where was the? It was back in Carvey's thingy, wasn't it? Oh my God, where? Oh no, that's to the dig site. It's on the other side. Must hold my breath till I find the rest. Oh, Lara, seriously. Oh, come on. I'm sure that was... Right, wait a minute. Was It was surely not all the way back. No, we can't open that. Where? I'm sure those were... Surely it was through one of those doors to get to that. Because I do remember trying to get those masks. I don't have to do that again, do I? Right, was that... Oh, wow, that weapon is floating. <laughs> oh, my God. I genuinely... 
Oh. Oh, come on, Lara. Come on. Actually, this staircase does look familiar. Oh, is this not where um we chase after Curtis? Oh my God, Lara. I think I've already bitched about her um her climbing upstairs animation. Oh, here we go. Seriously, did they honestly gas the whole bloody <laughs> the whole bloody building? Cause that's a lot of gas, right? Um, was it? Um. Oh dear. Oh no. Oh no. No. Oh fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love the way she dies in this game. <laughs> right. Okay. We know which way we're going. We know what direction we're going. What the fuck is this? I'm literally pressing the back button. I've got the back button firmly pressed down. Oh my god, Lara. Right, we seem to be doing okay this time, so I should make it in. Um, okay, open the door, Lara. Right, so was it straight ahead and through there? Oh shit, no, this is not where I thought it was. Oh bugger! Oh, fuck. oh, is it in Carvey's? Oh, Carvey's office, which is directly ahead. Come on, Lara! You are literally choking to death. You don't have time for nicety. Oh, oh no! Oh no! Which of these sodding rooms is it? Oh, is it is through there? Respirators, and not before time. Lara, hurry up! You're literally dying. You're dying, Lara, Lara, Lara. Come on, come on. Oh. My foot speed has increased. Oh God, this game. Bloody hell. <laughs> right, so this first door, I think. Was it? Yes. Respirators and not be Yeah, 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 just shut up and get in there, Lara. Mind you, she doesn't have a respirator on by the My time she meets. Has increased. Hold down the sprint button to run faster. Lara, put, who cares about your sprint speed? Put the bloody... Oh, that's the wrong button. Uh, items. Oh, shit. Oh, um, oh, oh, right, oh, right. I thought it was using it like a... Oh, no, it's still going down. It's just... Right, so what am I... Oh. I don't quite know what just happened there. Um. I don't know where I'm going. What was that light? Oh, uh, maybe I... See, I'm hesitant to go back downstairs because I know we chase Curtis down the, the steps. But maybe... Oh god, I don't know. But what was that light? That that looked like somewhere back in the... Oh bloody... Will you lock onto the person that's shooting you? Stupid person. Oh my god. Yeah, I... Uh, oh. Um, I, I did in my few attempts to get back to get to the respirator, um, I, I, it did occur to me that actually the thing to do is just put her gun away as soon as, as soon as you're done with it. Um, and then she won't flail about like a bloody idiot. Right, we need to, oh wow, I didn't realise it. 
Oh, where's the thingy gone? Oh, fuck. I was worried our, our respirator thingy had disappeared. Right, so, um... Oh, hi! Well, thank, thank, thankfully the uh, the camera just whips right round to an enemy when you got a weapon on it. I genuinely don't know where I'm going. I don't know what I'm doing. As if the game's told me what I'm meant to be doing, I'm afraid I've missed it like a bloody idiot. I'm kind of just following that computer game logic of, I oh, this is familiar. Oh, crikey, here we go. Here we go. Get ready for one of the most disturbing things I've ever seen in a game. I mean, oh, I don't know what they were thinking. I don't know if it's just because, I mean, presumably, oh, presumably, core design behind the scenes it was very male dominated maybe there wasn't a woman in the team to say hey guys this isn't sexy because you can tell that the way this is set up it's meant to look like it's sexy the way he's oh, his hands are on her and it's kind of suggestive this is not th this is gross this is Oh, no woman wants a man, a strange man's arm around her like that. I mean, look at Lara. She looks like she's just, like, th this is every woman's worst nightmare. That a man would do something like this to her. Like, just have her that powerless and put his hands wherever he wants because she can't stop him. I mean, honestly, she looks like she's getting, like, she... She looks like she's trying to mentally prepare herself for the rape attempt that's coming. This is not sexy and I oh I don't know what they were thinking. Oh god Lara, punch him in the nuts for me, would you? Oh uh because you can sort of see it's like oh oh I could kiss you right now if I wanted to. Oh <laughs> I hate Curtis Trent so much. Lara, don't fuck your Lara Croft. Don't just Stand there! You've taken down a truck and... Of course, I'm asking you to... Oh, again, this is all just cutscenes for the next few moments. Um, asking Lara to pick up her weapons first would be asking too much, because that's not how Angel of Darkness Lara rocks. <laughs> I love the way she's got time to look at this guy and see who he is while people are shooting at her. I mean, admittedly, um, I do like the idea of, I, th I, th I mean, I think this could have probably been done a bit better, but I do like the idea of Lara trying to chase after him and, and he's just like, he's just managing to stay one step ahead of her. I mean, I don't think it's done as well as it could, but, I mean, we've seen that, we we've seen that in uh, films numerous t I hate his smug smile but we've seen that in films numerous times where you know like our hero our protagonist I don't think that's rolling fast enough to squish him but you know our protagonist is trying <laughs> so I can't concentrate this is hilarious the this smug smile again I fucking hate Curtis Trent but you know this idea of the hero trying to catch somebody and this person's always just out of reach we've seen that many times in films so it's not like something like this can't be entertaining but um yeah i i hate i, I hate curtis trent so much do you know that um i i remember in the um oh wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute get ready for jiggly boobs in uh, three, two, one. <laughs> you 
should someday at some point put her glasses on. Quickly. Was anyone around when you got here? No, no one. Come on. Bouchard, I must get back to Von Croy's apartment. There's something I have to check out there. Your friend's place, of course. Where is it? Rue Valley, the Chantel building. Do you know it? My driver will. Get in. <laughs> the background isn't moving. What are you doing at the Louvre? <laughs> Some help. Thanks. Wouldn't you prefer somewhere safe? Oh, Bouchard. See, the I thing is, the in the that made him doing dead. that, he's clearly being coded as a bit of a creep and a weirdo, but how is I that any different to what Curtis no, just did to her? There's something you should know. The police bears were full of details of another monstrum killing in Prague. Not a dealer named Vasily. Matthias Vasily? Yes. You knew him? He's connected with what I need to find at Von Croy's apartment. I need to go in alone. Okay. I'll wait here. Appreciate <laughs> Oh my god, her boobs are just hanging there, jiggling about. <laughs> Wow, that phone is so 2003, isn't it? <laughs> She's inside now. You can send in the cleaner. <gasps> and I'm sure the cleaner isn't here to help with um, some uh, housework or something like that. I'm sure that's actually an assassin of some description. I'm shocked and stunned, ladies and gentlemen, shocked and stunned that Bouchard is actually uh, double-crossing us. Yes, now, the video that played at the beginning of the film, which was like this but different, um, the quality was pretty piss-poor on it. And I mean, obviously the quality in this video is not so good because it's an older game, but that's a hell of a lot better than what you get at the beginning of the, the game. So why, why did it start up with such a dreadful quality video? I mean, surely you don't want to start your, like, I mean, well, Angel of Darkness doesn't really get off to a great start, but still, you don't want to start your your game off with a a crappy video quality, uh, crap quality of video, do you? Maybe the cleaner's gonna uh, clean all that crap off the walls. Maybe that's what it is. Dramatic flash of oh, but actually we're not getting any um, thunder. Five obscure paintings for a client. People are dying out there. Handle it, Darren. Egypt, Werner. You walked away and left me. No, he didn't. Out. Get out of the way. Oh, who saw this plot twist coming? That it's just curious that the like I remember the marketing of this game kind of being like, oh, did Lara maybe kill somebody? It's kind of curious that they resolve that it's sort of the midpoint of the game. That is pretty gross because if you think about the amount of signs that are up on the wall, I mean, like he he must have had to go back to to Von Croy's guts an awful lot to scoop up some more blood. Oh, do you know I forgot to say, but this shot right here has always been a weird one for me because whose point of view is it? Because it's momentarily placing us outside of the building looking in. So it's always given me this sense that someone else was watching. I mean, maybe it's, um, what's his name, e Eckhard that's actually watching, but it's, it's a strange, I mean, core design did have some strange choices of, um, uh, camera thingamy stuff with, with their, uh, with their cutscenes. Uh, so let's save. <laughs> 